Well, each time we get a chance to talk to one of the trustees from the South Orange County Community College District, and our good friend Marsha Milchiker is joining us on the set today. I believe you've been on television here on Channel 6 for at least almost 30 years. Yeah, about 26 years, actually. Right, so I remember we used yeah. to come on with Rob back in the old studio. Yeah, and yeah, we always had fun here. Yeah, absolutely. It was really good. We enjoyed it. You've seen many changes in the between Saddleback and Irvine Valley in those yeah. many years, right? You know, um, when I was elected, we actually founded Irvine Valley College. Mm -hmm. So Irvine Valley College was founded in the same year that I was elected trustee. And now, of course, it's a full-service college with um, mm -hmm. wonderful classes, wonderful it's it's got the best transfer rate in the state of any community mm -hmm. college in the whole state right and um we were able to hire the best teachers at irvine valley college because we yeah. were <clears throat> able to hire them when it was more difficult for professors to get jobs and you know all of our professors have master's degrees or phds right. so um we can get the best and and that's it i mean i could be the best trustee in the world it, that won't mean our students will will be served but right. if we hire the best teachers that's that's who makes the difference for right. us for our and students. like you just mentioned uh, i went to a workshop at Salvat college for my daughter who's a senior at san juan hills high school great. and i thought it was really great that the irvine valley and Salvat college are basically feeder programs for some great universities not only in california but you know across the country as well and that's a great opportunity for our kids yeah it is great and so so when i say it is wonderful when i say that irvine valley college has the number one transfer rate in the state that means transfers to the four-year institutions mm -hmm. like UCLA and, and uh, all, all of the institutions all over the, all over the state. Right. And Saddleback is, I think, number three in the state. So, so, so they're really good colleges. So they're really, it's really good for students um, to go to Saddleback and Irvine Valley College, get the two years mm -hmm. uh, for much less than, <laughs> yes. than they would pay any place else, have guaranteed transfer to the UCs, at, at least the California schools. Absolutely. It's the easiest way to get into schools like UCLA and Berkeley, actually. Right. Great, that's yeah. a great opportunity. You brought a couple of slides and some uh, things you yeah. wanted to bring on. We also want to talk too, we have your uh, Merit Institute scheduled classes, and this is something that we'll have here at Channel 6, and they're throughout the recreation department and the clubhouses as well, but it gives you a great opportunity for people to look at some of the classes that uh, Meritus is offering as well. Yeah, and I, I, br I brought some extra brochures, um, so I'll leave them with you, so great. if anybody wants to come get them. There are, there, you, you could also pick up the brochures in, in the clubhouses mm -hmm. or um, in, in a lot of different locations throughout the, the South Orange County. Like, I, I'm taking an emeritus class myself now at, uh, in the Laguna Hills Community Center, and oh, they, have they have these brochures there also. Okay, super. Well, let's talk about your first summer session of 2015. Looks like registration is uh, coming upon us. Yeah, um, there's student registration is May 4th and 5th, but if the students want to register, what they should do is they should pick up the emeritus brochure or mm -hmm. go online and for the emeritus students, it really walks the students through how to do this. And so you have to sign up. And, and, and the, um, the, um, on the second last page in the Emeritus Institute brochure, there's, there's, a, um, a, 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 there, there's, there's a, a document oh, yeah. that they can fill out, appointment to register. Uh -huh. And then they can go to Clubhouse 4 in, in, in the morning and sign up for an appointment to register. Mm -hmm. So you sign up for the appointment to register, and this is how it's done statewide. Uh, this is how we have to do it as well. You have to sign up for an appointment to register, and that goes into the state of California. We don't know that, that's behind the scenes. And then they get an appointment to register. So hopefully they'll get one like May 4th or May 5th. Gotcha. And then, then th they will register online or go into the clubhouse, or mm -hmm. if they want to, they can come in person on May 13th and 14th to Clubhouse 4 and it'll, they'll help them register right. at, at that point yeah. also. So the first thing you want to do is fill out this application here and it's on the back page of this and it's actually just a couple of, uh, a couple of uh, questions actually and it's just your typical application for college and then once they fill this application out then they'll get their appointment to, to register yeah. them. Okay, yeah, great. that's right. Well, Absolutely. We encourage you all to do that. Well, what else do you have going on here? We've got a couple more slides we want to go through. Yeah, well, also classes start May 26th for, for the summer session. Okay. So it's, it's May 26th through the summer. And, of course, there's no classes on Memorial Day, no classes mm -hmm. on the 4th of July. It, it's July 3rd in this case, where mm -hmm. the, that's the holiday. Okay, so. very good. Well, let's so, take a look at the next slide. Here are your guest lecture series, and this is actually going to be here in Clubhouse 3. Yeah, and the, and the lecture uh, series is ongoing, 
and it's our very popular le lecture series because mm -hmm. we get experts in very many disciplines and different fields and they come in and discuss their particular fields and the way the emeritus classes work just so people know they're um, zero credit so that means they're free the regular mm -hmm. classes now at Saddleback College are um, $26 a credit hour mm -hmm. so no, I'm sorry $46 a credit hour excuse mm -hmm. me they've been creeping up very slowly yes. and so so when I first was elected as trustee they were five dollars a credit right. hour now they're forty six dollars a credit hour mm -hmm. so if you take a three-hour class it's like hundred and fifty dollars if you take a five-hour class it's two hundred and fifty dollars so it's still the best bargain in higher education in the state but it's incredibly more expensive than it was mm -hmm. when I first started as a trustee right. but anyway so if, if students want to take this um, guest lecture series it you, you could sign up at any time and because they're zero credits um, they're free there's mm -hmm. no cost to them but because of that they're also you can't use them for transfer you can't use them to get a degree they're right. just for um, helping you uh, improve your brain helping you learn a lot yeah. uh, uh, really learning very very interesting things mm -hmm. and there's no real grade either right no, I mean, no obviously grades. the teacher is trying to help you to progress in whatever yeah. You know whatever class you're taking yeah. but you're not going to be you know trying to pa pass or fail a class you you're just participating and like you said learning something yeah yeah and, and they're so they're um no midterms and no finals mm -hmm. because they're they're uh zero credit mm -hmm. so the, you, yeah you don't get a grade so right. you don't worry about failing the class if, if you <laughs> yeah, miss a few just classes be a part of it yeah now you have a uh, bonnie and clyde coming on april 10th that's going to be this weekend wow yeah this weekend and next weekend uh -huh. and it's a musical yeah. and it's at the mckinney theater and for students and seniors it's only ten dollars and mm -hmm. it's it's these musicals at saddleback and irvine valley are just wonderful and, right. and this is at the 400 seat mckinney theater every seat's wonderful i read about bonnie and clyde it's a new musical and it's supposed to be really fun and really mysterious and they said uh, nobody under 15 is allowed to go so mm. so you have okay. to be 15 years old to, to be able yeah. to attend we all know the story of bonnie and clyde uh, yeah. you know maybe there's a lot of violence talk in about it. troublemakers yeah. but i understand they're uh, going to do a remake of the original uh film and oh, they're great. looking for some you know obviously be some young talent and uh, it should yeah. be interesting so yeah. but then we're going to go off and do some big band swing thing yeah and this this is this weekend also it's a saddleback college and um it's it's inexpensive. Well, it's twenty five per person because it's a fundraiser for mm -hmm. our for our uh, scholarships. I just want to we give out a million dollars in scholarships every year. So you know how um, our tuition is much higher, mm -hmm. but we really uh, try our best to make sure that students don't leave our college with any debt. Mm -hmm. So if students can't afford the college, we have wonderful scholarships, a mm -hmm. uh, million dollars in scholarships raised in the community. No taxpayers pay for this mm -hmm. for our students to help our students go through the college without paying any debt at all and yeah. really helping our it's students. It's a great opportunity. Yeah. A Midsummer but, Night's Dream is another one, huh? Yeah, it's, it's also this weekend at, um, at Irvine Valley College and this is at the Performing Arts Center. Beautiful, beautiful new building. I, I would go to this just to see the beautiful new building. It's a, it's a gorgeous building. <laughs> yeah, very nice. So, and and that's really a close to us. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's it, really close to you. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. So that should be a great opportunity. And most of these are college students who are yeah. part of the performance? Yeah, in, in, in the uh, academic year, they're college students. And, mm -hmm. and so the college students take classes and they mm -hmm. want to go into the theater. And right. in the summer, there are some equity artists that, that play at Saddleback College when they have the big... Um, performances in the summer but th these are mostly students performance right. but they're great I mean they're really great yeah. uh, they're really good they're very and good. they're a bargain for, for ten dollars you pay that much to go to the movies now you know absolutely this is a live performance yeah this is going to be the eighth annual student composers benefit concert and this sounds more of a kind of the classical uh, type of music yeah it is the uh, Irvine Valley College has some as I said extremely talented faculty members that are just tops in their field and and they have the students that are composers and mm -hmm. these students go to the top universities in in, in the nation mm -hmm. and um, this is raising money uh, for students that need it that are in this particular discipline but these are in this performance you'll see uh, performances by students written by students so wow. it's, it's it's incredible it really it's a great is. opportunity yeah, it now is. the trustees you meet once a month and uh, when do you meet in obviously residents in our community especially those that are part of the emeritus program they're welcome to, to participate in some of your meetings as well yeah they can all the meetings are at Saddleback College mm -hmm. and they're um, the usually ordinarily they're the last um, the last uh, Monday of, of the month okay. ordinarily that 
but uh, sometimes they're a little bit uh, earlier than that. In November, it's two weeks earlier than that. Right. So you have to watch the schedule. But if you want to watch, you could come to the meetings. We welcome anybody to come to the meetings. Um, welcome anybody to contact me if you want. I'm, you know, yeah. you, you could find me. And, and also, um, all of our meetings are televised. And, and are they online now? And they're all online. They're totally okay, all online. Great. So if you look at the Saddleback web website, mm -hmm. go to Saddleback College. I'm a geek at heart. I'm, I don't know <laughs> if I'm a geek, but I'm a geek at heart, and I, and I love this stuff. Yeah. So, so you just go to uh, the Saddleback College website, and then um, you, you go to the Board of Trustees, and you could mm -hmm. watch all of our meetings online. If you really are uh, have a few hours and you don't know what to do, that, that's, 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 that, that would be something that you might be yeah. very bored. It'll put you right to sleep, so it's, it's, it's a great thing to watch. You know? Yeah. But I believe, too, do you have where you, know, you can click on an agenda item and it'll go right to the topic that you all yeah, were discussing? Yeah, we'll do that. So that's all really of our nice. agendas are online also. Yeah, yeah, so if you have something that you, uh, you know, are particularly interested in and you just click yeah. on that agenda item, it'll actually take you to that part of the meeting. So you don't have to watch the three-hour board meeting yeah. and just watch what's of interest to you. And that's yeah, really that's nice true. To Absolutely, have. it is mm -hmm. nice. All this, we have great technology in our district. We really do. We have one of the best websites in the nation, mm -hmm. I think. Right. <laughs> well, it's uh, been a pleasure to see you once again. And okay. uh, you know, again, you've been with Meredith for what 26 years. Yeah, now? and I've been fighting for the Emeritus all those years. Yes, you when have. I first was elected, um, it was really threatened statewide and mm -hmm. we fought and we won and we, we were able to save it and this is statewide right and then recently it was threatened again and people from this district actually came and helped us fight and, and win again right. and now I'm old enough to take classes myself I can't believe it so I'm taking a natural history of Southern California which has wonderful field trips in the community mm -hmm. and wonderful um, we're going to the salt marsh today last week we went to we, we, we did running with the Grunions last week. Okay. It was to see the Grunion run, yeah. so very exciting. Art Great. classes, yeah. you know. And, and you meet nice people, too. You meet very nice people. It's, it's, it's a lifeline to some people. They're very important classes, Absolutely. I think. You know, very important. Yeah. Thanks so much for joining us on the program today. It was great to see you okay. once again. Yeah, well, be sure you. and pick up your Emeritus Institute schedule of classes. These are going to be out going on uh, throughout the community. You can pick them up here at Channel 6. We do have a couple of them. If not, we'll probably send you down to the Recreation Department. Again, they're available at the clubhouses as well. So uh, be sure and pick that up. They do have a registration starting the first week of May. We're going to be back with more of the program right after this. Hi, you're doing great. Yeah.